in this session let's see how we can track changes to the data okay this can be achieved using the flashback version query okay for a given specific row if you want to track what happened during a specific time period yes you can do that okay undo retention parameter plays a major role okay it holds the number of seconds the database will be tracking your changes okay so if you want to see how the region value changed in the customer table between this time and this time for the customer id 12 you can see that okay so version start scan number okay so it just assigns a number and this is the start time okay and again the version ending scan number and the version ending time and it gives a id for the entire version and the operation whether it is an insert or an update or a delete and the column for which we need to track and then from table name which is our customer versions between timestamp and the two timestamps okay we want to find out how the data looked for the region column between these two timestamp okay now let's go and execute this now let me run this so let me run this SQL you see it is throwing an error it says the lower limit snapshot expression was below the undo retention limit that means it is saying I don't have so much history okay reduce your range so that I can give you the value how much is my retention so that uh, using the show parameter retention I can find out so I execute that you see the undo retention is 900 which means it can hold only for 900 seconds okay that means you can track the changes which happened for the last 900 seconds which is equal to your 15 minutes if you want to increase that of course you can increase that by informing your database administrator okay your starting timestamp should be always greater than or equal to current time minus 15 minutes okay so I change that to 1950 and execute that it displayed so the latest record is displayed first okay at 751 it was changed to north okay now let me go and change this to south or may maybe east okay so I run that and it is updated and let me commit that and let me change this to 7 okay because the time is 807 and let me execute this okay you see one more record is inserted at 806 we changed it to east and what was the operation which changed it to east it was update even here it was update you see during this 15 minute interval it is showing how the data was changed it was south and then at 751 it was changed to north and again at 806 it was changed to east so these were the changes which happened during the 15 minute interval okay so whenever you are using your flashback version query be careful and work with your database administrator to increase the undo retention parameter okay